Usaha. We're heading to, I forget what mountain, honestly. The Atlas Mountains, obviously. We're gonna grab breakfast really quick and then the driver's picking us up here, which is incredible. So everything is super lax at this hotel. And it's like 8.45 and they're just getting breakfast ready, which is perfectly fine. I mean, I'm used to stuff much earlier, but I hope this guy comes a little bit late. So we have time to eat. Cake and olives. Well, that looks good. I think that is a pancake. Mm -hmm. All right, I've been chowing down, but this reminds me of some of the Indian bread we've had. I feel so bad. They just brought out the other eggs, and then we had to leave because our tour guide's here. Sorry. Mm -hmm. Hi, I'm Lane. Lane, nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Oh, nice to meet you. Thank you for getting us. Thank you so much. Oh. We have a serious crew. <laughs> I don't know how I feel about this. <laughs> Alyssa. <laughs> She's dropping nuggets. You know, just Morocco, you have, they are native to Asia. Asia, okay. Asia yeah. Ah, In North Asia. Africa, yeah. Middle East, you have just the Madeira with one half. And the half, there's just fun. Okay. When they eat, they feed them, if you remember this, they face it after long years. If you treat them that way, they will return one day. So they remember you? Yeah, I'm I hate to be a buzzkill because I always do this, but I know they. They tr probably treat them well, but it always makes me sad when it's like a little like stand on the side of the road and you know it's like a tourism business. Like it's not like we're camping in the desert and we need them to get out there. I don't know. They're beautiful animals. But yeah, I'm not gonna ride one. Although I will say like, I understand they're, these animals have been used for years and years and years for this, but if it was for a purpose, they're just tied so closely. And he was saying how they're such smart animals and they remember faces. Yes, it's easy one because if you have longer scarf, you can do it different way. That's enough, twisting, because it will hurt your head. Yeah. Go, let's go, let's go. And then under? Yeah. Like up, under or up? up? Yeah, yeah just to pass it on, on, on the top of this one again. And then tuck? Yeah, uh, again. Again? Wrap it again. Yes. Of course I'd have the pink. pink. No. Swap. Pink's my least favorite color. <laughs> I'll give you the blue. No, amazing. No. <laughs> and then that comes across. Yeah. Oh, you have beautiful eyes. Thank you. Beautiful eyes. Yes. you. <laughs> yeah, you too. Uh, let's see, with the scarf it adds another touch. Huh? Thank you. Yeah. <laughs> Mine's not like low enough. There we go. This will be a thumbnail. My shoes are gonna be so nasty. And Kev just got me these. And they got poop all over them now. We're gonna meet the baby camels. Always hungry, they eat everything. Always hungry and they eat everything. That's like me. <laughs> so that's the head honcho. And he is the father of the, all the baby camels. Really? Yeah. The baby. The white camels are more respected. For the Saharian people. Yeah. They're beautiful. Oh, <laughs> hi. Oh, Hello. Oh my god. Oh, go in for a kiss. Kev, camel's coming at me. That's like elephants. Remember when we saw elephants and you can like see in their eyes and you see they're so smart? Yeah. Hungry? Me too. <laughs> oh, hey. Hey, how are you? <laughs> that scared the crap out of me. I understand that it's safe for them to ride them, but Alyssa and I just hung out with the little babies while they were riding. And this, this little baby is so sweet as I step in all the poop. Oh my god. Maybe a little camera shy because now I have my big camera. <laughs> Now I think we're gonna have some tea. Um, yeah, we'll have more. Called Skaspas. 
Kasba. Kasba is a main fortress or the main residence area for a group of farmers. So, fresh man, my friend. So, how do you say cheers? Saha. Saha. The last one to be served is said to get married next. We will have a lot of whiskey today. I'm realizing that Alyssa was right and we probably could have rented a car and done like a little road trip. Although I definitely didn't feel safe, but after being here, it would have completely been fine. Um, so next time. We just stopped on the side of the road and these are almond trees and he's saying we can try and find some and pick some almonds. Love stopping on the side of the road. Almonds? There's another one. Come on. There's one there, yeah. Yeah, yeah, I can see one. Oh, this? Yeah. There's one if you want to grab it. Yeah. Thank you. <laughs> Get it? Do you peel it? Or oh, sticky? Yes, you peel it. Crack the nut. Right. No, no. Like oh. puppet? They are good fresh, huh? They are good fresh like this. We can eat them with their with their shell. Yeah. What? Like you eat them with the shell? <laughs> really? You eat this? No, the fuzzy? No, that's <laughs> Is that the almond? I don't know. I guess. That does not look like an almond. Hey. <laughs> uh, me, me, it's almond. <laughs> <gasps> Donkeys! <laughs> Wait, look. Oh, they're behind the car now, of course. I look crazy, okay. What do you do with this gooey stuff? I don't know. Okay, you just bit it? Mm-hmm. I cracked it open and then ate the inside. There's literally no almond. Oh wait, this would have been the almond, right? Yeah, I think. Okay. Tastes like our fruit. Please don't give me hives. <laughs> me and the hives, man. Okay. Yeah, that's definitely what the almond would have been if it turned brown. Wow, I never knew they were gooey on the inside. I'm zoomed in. So it's like gooey on the inside? Those brains. <laughs> that was sweet. Wasn't really ripe, but I love almonds. Oh my god, I think it's worked. Oh my head. <laughs> now it's if you pick them this, yeah. like this is not uh, ripe yet. Okay. You eat them with the shell, but the shell become hard now. Okay. So it's be, be hard. So we just crack them and they get the nut inside. Oh wow, that's so nice. This, this one is almost. <gasps> yes, Alyssa. Oh, okay, that's, that's so cool. cool. <laughs> Ooh, it tastes funny. What do you mean? <laughs> what do you strong. mean? They're strong. Yeah, yeah. Some some of them yeah, because these ones are not genetically mm. modified. It's the Natural. first, you know, mm. the original. Oh, I want to try. try one. I'm, I'm so intrigued. Spit it out, though. Interesting. Nah, it doesn't taste bad. It just doesn't taste like an almond, you know. Mm -hmm. Olive oil, mm -hmm. this is the argan oil, and this is a mixture yes. of argan oil, honey, yeah. almonds, and also you can yes, add peanuts. Ooh. It's called amlu. Yeah. Like peanut butter. They're bringing us a second breakfast, and I've never been so excited. Oh wow, that's wow. real talent. Wow. <laughs> He's like, they're so simple minded, they think this is cool. <laughs> Everyone must get a fair share of tea. It's a responsibility more than an honor. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Oh yeah, second breakfast. This is awesome. <laughs> Berber Nutella. Berber Nutella. It's just how if you want to make it sweeter, you add more honey. So this is the Berber Nutella, right? Yeah, it is. Try the oil, yeah. It's good. No, but actually... You know how to come and lie down? Oh my gosh, that's delicious. She knew I needed a shopping basket. You can put it in. Alright, that was great. Once again, spent more money than I wanted to, but we are oily as heck. But it's a good oil. I wasn't sure, but we are going hiking and I am so excited. 
Trekking? They call it trekking here, right? I always call it hiking, but every other country calls it trekking. Like me, we are bird. Yeah, this uh, scene it was sh partly shot along the zigzag. Wow. And also in the near the Hassan II mosque in Casablanca. Yeah. And the, in the highway between Agadir and uh, Marrakesh city. So the Mission Impossible 5. That's so cool. Yeah, in the, uh, so we're in the Atlas Mountains? Oh, yes, already in the Atlas Mountains. It's our nickname, Northern Goats in the city. So many goats? We call us Berbers from the mountains, they are mountain goats. We are... Baby goats. Small, grown, Aww. very slow. Oh my goodness. Yes. Good scams. Turn to the Casbah, right here. See the sign, Barakak. See Richard Bronson, the Moroccan retreat. The highest ski lift in Africa, wow. in Ukambi Mountain. There is nobody there. Okay, in Berber it means nobody. And uh, are you hungry or you prefer to go for walk first? At Alam to walk. We have different options. Walk for an hour, an hour and a half. That's nice. shorter. I love hiking. Yeah. So yeah. whatever you guys yeah. want. You love hiking? Yeah. 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 Something, yeah. something a bit uh, mixed. Yeah. You know, challenging. And, uh, not that challenge, but that's the uh, place. Uh... No one cares.